Good day, friends. I am back with another movie about our GEE Tech A10 printers. I am going to actually show you how to install the Easy Print software because the GTEC software is one of the easiest ways to upgrade the firmware. So check it out as I show you what I learned about installing it. All right, friends. So let's start out by finding the GEE Tech Easy uh, software. When you type it in, it takes you right to the special page where the software is. We want to download Easy Print 3D. It takes us to the forums, which I do recommend you signing up for. I'm going to move down to the download section. And right here is a link for Easy Print for Windows. And I'm just going to download it from this Google link. You can see it pops up a zip. Don't launch it. Make sure you download it. Your computer may ask where you want it. Uh, mine, I did not have it set for that, so it is just in my download folder. I'm gonna hit show in folder, and then I'm gonna extract it. And I'm just gonna extract it to that location. And then I am gonna right click on that file and do run as administrator. I'm gonna tell it yes. Click next like we always would, and this is where it gets crazy. I need to do custom because I found that my system got stuck in a loop because it tried to install both uh, Visual C+. I've got a 64-bit PC, so I'm only going to do the 64-bit update. And tell it next and let it do its thing, and it should install in just a few moments. And there it was, that quick. When I hit finish, it is ready to launch with a simple click of the easy 3d button now I've already given you a link of how to use it so I'll have you move to that but I do want to show you something if you hit printer printer and pick which one you want I want mine to be the a10 when I click the a10 and I check its configuration under printer settings this is the craziest thing that I noticed it is set for 250 percent flow right out of the box and you can test that yourself uh, I changed mine of course to hundred percent the rest of these I left the same I like to print at 210 I'd let my bed be at 50 or 55 um, need to set this to 210 as well I'm gonna actually set that at 200 so that first layer is a little cooler the rest of these numbers I leave the same. Double check my A10 machine center is zero. That is a weird setting as well because we think it's the front left corner. Feed rate, all those things I left the same. And then under parameters, this is where you can change your printer quality for whatever you want. I like to print 0.3 layers. So that's an adjustment I made. But once again, this is all in the other settings. I already showed you how this is weird, how you have to hit the X to actually quit. And you are ready to start using EasyPrint 3D 1.26. Thanks for watching. Stay tuned for a later video where I show you how to update firmware. I hope you found this useful. And if you have any questions, please leave them down below. If you like the movie, please hit the like button. And if you haven't hit subscribe, please hit subscribe. Friends, thanks for watching. Have a great day.